A Sicilian chicken dish made by a personal chef in your home. Yes, please. Silverio Pagano is a personal chef with Friend That Cooks. Welcome back to the show, my friend. Good to have you. How are you? Welcome back. What is that? Yes, Benvenuti. Okay. Yeah, what he said. Yes. Okay, so what are we making today, chef? We are doing a Sicilian chicken piccata. It is uh, originally from a northern Italian region yes. of Emilia Romagna. And uh, we are making it uh, more the same, which we add the, uh, the mushrooms and the tomatoes and capers are still in there from, uh, from the northern region. So chicken, it's a little different. Chicken piccata, always a crowd favorite, but we're giving it a little spin. You're giving a little variation Absolutely. on the theme. Okay, excellent. So I see we've got our chicken breast in there. It's cooking up. Got a nice sear on it from both sides. Okay. We are, uh, as I am, uh, normally I would go ahead and, since time restraints, we're going to uh, speed up the process and add saute our onions and garlic. Onions and garlic. And then we're going to add some uh, mushrooms to that. All right, now, any tips for people who want to sear their chicken at home? Exactly. Any I would tips? Um, definitely get your pan hot first. And then, uh, if you want to use a little bit less oil, mix up your chicken in like a mixing bowl and then add your seasonings. All right. And then throw it straight into the pan. Got it. Nice, hear that sound? Yeah, that's what we're looking yes. for. <laughs> now, are there any other regions in Italy that make this dish? Yes, there's uh, Emilia Romagna, which uh, is right above Tuscany. Uh, if you're familiar with the uh, the Italian uh, um, the boot, the boot, yes, <laughs> shall we say? Uh, and then uh, you'll see that more as the tradition because it was really from veal uh, piccata. But then we came to America and we did uh, chicken piccata. So. And then you start to see that again over in Italy. And you just threw some capers in there. That is kind of the signature exactly. ingredient for Exactly. And the lemon juice and the white wine. You got to have that. Love I can't it. forget. Gabish. <laughs> Hello. Excellent. Now, Excellent. while we're cooking up a storm, tell our viewers a little bit more about Friend That Cooks. What do you do? Excellent. Well, you know, I go to uh, people's homes. They ask us to, to, to sign up, and they, but there's no contracts, there's no fees, and we just. Uh, go to do a consultation with them and then uh, we, uh, we decide what they want to eat, how they want to eat it. We go from healthy uh, approach, all different ways of being healthy. I've lost uh, a lot of weight I because of it. I know, this is the last time you were on the I show. I got rid of my twin brother. Got hey, got <laughs> Yeah, you said you lost about 50 pounds. Good for you, exactly. chef. Looking good. You know what I said, though? Never trust a skinny chef. Well, you, you know, know what I said. the heart is still the same. Okay, atta boy. <laughs> All right. So what did you just put in there? I just put some white wine okay. and uh, actually, no, chicken stock. Okay. And I'm going to add the white wine. Add the vino. A little Gotta vino. Got to have a little vino little in there. A little vino would be keno. Now, what's the most common request from your customers? I, am I, I would guess paleo. Is it paleo? Paleo, exactly right. Uh, and there's, it's starting to be, uh, I think, very, very popular. We're starting to see people eating uh, no gluten, no, uh, um, no dairy, just kind of getting away from some of those things to help their own health situation. And it's just made a world of difference in myself. So, and I'm keeping going. So <laughs> you, you go, boy. All right. So a little saute on that. Now, what is your favorite part about being a personal chef? Well, I think my favorite part is really just getting to do meet the people, get to, to really feel like I'm a part of their family, to feel like uh, we're definitely uh, involved in what we're doing and how we're doing it with them. Um, and just making a decision based upon their regular routine every, every week. And I think that it's, uh, it's awesome. And I have both customers that want to be healthy, and some people just want to eat uh, some, you know. Well, sign me up stuff. next week. <laughs> I, want, I want comfort food. That's all I want. That's all you want. <laughs> all right, you plate that up. I'm going I'm to give it a try here in a sec. Now, exactly. if you want to give this Sicilian chicken piccata a try, we're going to have the full recipe on our website for you. You're going to be able to find it later today on our website, Casey Live. Dot TV. You have one right here for me. I'm going to dig in. I'm going to, I'm going to have that hot one during the conversation. Ah, but I'm going to dig in right now. Hey, up next, we're going to.